I'm going to show a quick demo of building and running Wikipedia Mobile using Cordova QT, also known as PhoneGap, with a Nokia N9 phone. The first step is to fire up the Qt SDK. I'm running this on a Linux desktop and have the Mego Harmattan development tools installed in the Qt Creator IDE. From the IDE we select Create Project and then Project from Version Control and git repository clone. Then we enter the clone URL. And in our case we need to select the branch where the QT version is located. And select next. After a few seconds, the code is checked out. Unfortunately, the project file is in a subdirectory and Qt Creator doesn't automatically find it. So let's manually open the project that we just checked out using Open Project. Now let's select the targets we want to build for. Let's deselect desktop and choose the Qt simulator. As well as Migo Harmattan PR 1.2, which is what I'm running on my Nokia N9 phone. Project's now loaded. Let's build it for the Qt simulator that runs on our desktop. So we hit build and we can see a compile progressing. And once that's done we can now run it. And the Wikipedia mobile application comes up in the simulator and we can run it under the simulator on our desktop. Now let's close the simulator and select to run it on a real phone. So we select Harmattan. and select to build it now for the Harmattan target using the cross compiler. Now we select under run to run on uh, a real device, my N9 which is my phone which I earlier set up for development with the Qt SDK. So we select run and the ID packages up the code, uploads it and installs it on the phone over Wi-Fi. And after a few seconds the application comes up on the phone. The steps for this demo are on our project wiki page if you want to try it out. There's also a link there to a longer YouTube video demonstrating the, the QT version of Wikipedia Mobile. The PhoneGap or Cordova QT version of Wikipedia Mobile is currently uh, approximately alpha code and has a number of issues, but it's planned to be improved over time as Cordova QT continues to be developed.